Hello everyone, welcome back to another CapCut Online video. In this one, I'm using their free background image and video remover. That's right. You'll see here, for example, I've got a video of a puppy dog that I just downloaded off of Pexels for free. And you can see here, he's just sort of being cool and asking for free kisses. And I managed to cut out the background, replace the background, no watermark, for free, and I put him on top of a sphinx. How did I do this? I'm going to show you to do this step by step. And keep in mind, there's no cost on this. So let's go starting from scratch. All right, so the first step is you need to go to CapCut.com. Keep in mind that this is not the app that you download to your phone, your iPad, or to your desktop, for example, or laptop. This is an online video editor. It has the tools built in, so you don't need to download anything. So it's pretty sweet. And again, it's free. So let's get right into it. So here we go. You come to this website here, links in the description below. You get two options, sign up or sign in. Both are free. I'm going to click on sign in and I'm going to sign in with my Gmail account. So I've got an email account that just a basic Gmail account. And if you have a Gmail, TikTok, Facebook, or even a CapCut mobile account, you can just click on it and use that to sign in. So here we go. I'm just going to go ahead. These notes is my email. So there we go. I'm just going to click one click login and then presto. It's going to take you right here to the front screen. Okay, we are inside the CapCut online editor. Now we get a few options, but if we look at the side here, you'll see something that says magic tools. If you click on that, this basically takes you to their AI fancy section. So if you are familiar with, uh, you know, all sorts of different AI and videos, well, CapCut is keeping pace. And in fact, their background remover might be the best one yet. So here we go. So here we are in magic tools, go down a little bit, and then you'll see for videos, now you can remove backgrounds of images and videos, but videos are a little more difficult. So I'm going to show you how to do it with video. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on remove background and presto, it's going to open up a new tool here. or It's going to open up a new browser, so to speak. And now I'm going to show you the techniques. Let's go through it step by step. All right, here we go. So you'll see here it has auto removal background remover. It's basically all automatically turned on. What you can do here is you can use one of their videos or images if you want to try it out but I like to use my own here. So I'm just going to click on this upload button and then it's going to ask me to upload a video to remove the background. We're going to go through the uh, same one here. So I've got this French bulldog with the free kisses on it. I'm going to go ahead and remove the reddish pink background. You see here, it takes a few seconds. I'll come back when it's done. I'll show you the next steps. I didn't even have to go off. I didn't have to turn it off. It was that quick. That is pretty awesome. So you'll see here now the background is green. Basically what's happened is, is it's basically giving you the green light. <laughs> no pun intended that the background's gone. If you want to check, you can always go over here to the right side and you can click on this background. And all you got to do is you can select a different color. So if I wanted a yellow background, bang, I've gone ahead and added in a different color. I'm not going to do that in this case, though. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click on this one here that says video. So I'm going to remove the background, but this time I'm going to upload my own video. So I want this cute dog doing something with, with a background video and I'm going to select it. So I'm going to click upload and then I'm going to select from this device. In this case, I've got an image of, I guess, like a Christmassy uh, village. So I'm going to go ahead and upload that. It should be very quick. Holy smokes, it's already done. And now if I hit play, look at that. I've got the bulldog in front of this cute little Christmas village. And it has that nice depth of uh, field effect applied to it already. Now, in this case, the bulldog is a little bit too big. So I'm just going to click on it. And then I'm going to grab one of these handles. And then I just got to double click on it, pardon me. And I'm going to slowly reduce its size. So here you go. I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to put him on his little stool right here. And this way I've gone ahead and adjusted the size. And now if we go back to the beginning and I hit play, look at that. I've got this French bulldog in this cool Christmassy type uh, environment. And I did all of that. And now for the coup d'etat, let me show you how to export it and the final steps. All right. So to go ahead and export it, you guessed it. It's the export button up here at the top, right? I'm just going to click on that export. And now I get a few options. I can save it as a project. If I think I'm going to reuse this, then I would go ahead and do that. And if I clicked on these advanced options, look at this, I can select the quality. So I'm going to go with high quality because why not? Frame rate, I'm going to keep it at 30 frames per second. But if you want a higher frames per second, you can go ahead and do that. If you're doing something with slow motion, for example, as well as the style, I'm going to go ahead and click on export. It's going to go ahead now and basically get ready to spool this up and have it ship out. Then I'm going to show you the final step where you can actually share it directly to your TikTok or your various other social media. 
All right, so here we go. Here's an example of what it looks like. If I hit play, you'll see here we've got our awesome background that we pulled out the old background, put in a new background, fire truck, yeah. On the right, see, right side here, I could share it to TikTok, I could share it to YouTube, YouTube Shorts, because it's in the vertical for, uh, format, for example, if you wanted to do it that, Facebook groups, Facebook page, Instagram, and then my favorite actually is just to click on download, because if you do it this way, you can just download it and then decide what you wanna do with it later. And that's it, we've gone ahead and downloaded it, and literally, that's it. So CapCut Online, the link is in the description below. It's free. There's no watermark. It's an absolutely amazing tool. You should try it out. Link's in the description. Thanks for watching.